Hello and good afternoon, everybody. Uh, back here on a Tuesday, October 17th, 2023, for my latest updates for today. Uh, interesting course of events that we have happening. We have Xi and Putin meeting in Beijing as we speak. Uh, we had the Biden make a phone call to Prime Minister Sudani in Iraq, uh, most likely to discuss um, American relations and how America wants to help Iraq in the exchange process for a change instead of obfuscating and getting in the way. Uh, meanwhile, you have Russia and China who are aggressively vying for Iraq to revalue on the digital platform uh, because that's going to help them with the China-Taiwan conflict, which, by the way, I posted some information on one of the channels that shows that that, co that conflict is imminent in the next 48 to 72 hours. We knew it was coming. al Qadimi, one of the finance ministers in Iraq, is... is uh, changing the interest rate with the banks. That's another preparatory measure for Iraq to revalue. As I was contemplating the information, I also wanted to let you folks know that there is a real possibility, as Kim Clement talked about, we discussed last week in the why, why now moment and the grave surrender. What if the grave surrender includes Iran and Turkey and Egypt? Since we know that Erdogan is coming to Iraq here either this month or next month to sign the oil and gas law, although it's not a necessary prerequisite for the dinar to revalue because they're going to go digital, it is something that they can officially record in the books and document accordingly, uh, which certainly doesn't hurt them. So what if that is the uh, part of the grave surrender that these three countries take? And Iran, as the big brother to Iraq, would free their hands off their little brother, which would in turn benefit them as well, both in the short and the long term. Something to consider. Again, as a friend and a reminder, I'm doing a show tomorrow with Nick Veniamen, where we're going to be doing strictly on this episode a Q&A session. So any last questions you have, please post them in the comments section. We have been taking notes of your, your questions so far. We will probably be fielding the most commonly asked questions up front and then some of the more unique and obscure ones towards the end of the show uh, in its truncated form. But we have taken note of all your questions and we will be giving... Uh, very specific answers to that. So relax. You will have peace of mind. You will get your needs addressed. Just remember to be thinking about how you can be in continuous service to others and not just be so concerned about how you're going to exchange or which banks are going to work for you. That will all get sorted out. Be thinking about the people that you can bless, including your families and the outreach programs that you have in mind. Thanks so much. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.